So let me start with a question to you. Who thinks VL is descaling DL? Raise your hands. Okay, I'm done. Your turn. <laughs> <laughs> I've introduced the VL in my department in 2007, and since then, everyone uses it all the times when I'm around. <laughs> Which can also be called, uh, it took me 15 years to realize that I miserably failed in what is evident, that using a device that allows you to share the view is the best available device for the patient's care, for the way we treat our airways, etc., etc. I was brought up by a generation of magician of intubation. When nothing was possible, you could call the magician, he would do something called DL, and all of a sudden it was possible to achieve the goal. And we've come to a time where the pseudo expert is trying to teach, and the junior is telling the pseudo expert how to manage it because he can't do it. And this is exactly how it should be. We share the view, we get the input from everybody, and we maximize the efficiency by looking at everybody, understanding the airway, understanding the problem. I can't put the tube in, and you will see his finger say, hey, push it to the left side, and you will manage. Hey, do it. Oh, thank you, thank you. <laughs> and this is the world we live in. And this is called VL, because we share, we understand, we teach, and we learn ourselves by doing that, by getting the inputs from everybody. When I introduced VL in April 2007, and we had a quick assessment of how was the difficult area management done before, in blue, and after, and you can see that by using VL, we dramatically reduced the numbers of intubation with DL, we dramatically reduced the intubation with fibroscopes, and we changed the practices in induction. Has it killed DL? Not sure, but it has changed the pattern of our experience with specific devices. So the question is cost. We are losing some skills. We just need to understand and then compensate what we have lost by maybe doing some training. This is the just published Swiss Airway Guidelines. We allocate specific tasks, skills, and then we integrate that because we share the view with a team approach. And I think it's a fantastic graphical way to understand how the dynamic approach to the airway can include technical skills, non-technical skills, and it's a dynamic thing. And if seeing is believing, understanding is much better. And this is what VL allows. I would take as a home account, say, VL, how about routine? And DL, for some specific situations, might still be necessary. It's a happy marriage. Thank you very much.